They'll be calling you a radical. Please, please, all you regurgitating goats, stop with the El Nino nonsense. Please stop. Stop it, California. Please stop now. Stop. Stop with the El Nino nonsense. Look, warm currents occur in oceans for freaking centuries. They do not genocide the entire Pacific Ocean. This is the greatest event in human history. I named it the Great Pacific Genocide on March 12, 2011. Nuclear fission, gamma rays from hell, the heat source from hell pouring into the freaking Pacific Ocean for five years. In California, the denial. You're watching all the creatures just wash up dead. I've been reporting it from the inception. This migration, this evolution, the cross the wide Missouri on Balco, the manifest destiny on Balco. It's simple. It's simple. You know, hello. You know, hello. Hello. This was made in Vienna. Hello, stop. Stop. Please stop. This is freaking Fukushima. Look, all the animals are starving to death. The marine biologists, Noah, all of them, they, they go on and on and on and on. None of them will come up. They're spending trillions and billions of dollars, and I will say this about the California. They're walking along, they see it right in their face. You know, walking their dog, freaking whatever, but hello. Why, why, why? Because you talk to them, and it's like they're hypnotized. Whatever, it blows away their fairy tale. Because then they start thinking about their glass house they've created, their own personal Ponzi scheme they've created called their property values. They start to think, oh, this blow, this can't be. This is, oh, it's coming back, right? You know, the fish, the crab fishery, they close them, clap the up. I want to say this, my whistleblower's in Oregon. The only salmon they caught are pure white. You know, the natives up there are saying, look, we're starving. They know that they're, oh, so, you know what they told me yesterday? Oh, it's just the food is switched. They lost all their shrimp. That's all. It's that's all. That's all. There's no nutrients in the ocean. The tide pools are dead. The plankton is gone. The Pacific Ocean is dying, right? This is the greatest event in human history. The Great Pacific Genocide. The greatest denial in human history. The most grotesque populace in human history. Me, 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 me. I got my gun. I got my dog. Me, 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 my cocoon. This is a freaking, I mean, wow. You know, the cancer epidemic is on. Mowing you down, dead. People are in denial. They just go on with their fairy tale. Stop with the El Nino nonsense. Warm currents do not genocide the Pacific Ocean. They do not kill the entire greatest ecosystem on the face of the earth. Hello, what is the matter with you people? You know, this is the greatest story ever told. And I want to say this, my activism, the people that have supported me, and you know I need funding, and this work that we've done is so historic, so grand. I want to say how important it is. You know, I'm the tip of this spur, you know, the money. Look, the closing of San Onofre was a small, teeny group of us. I'm in that bone marrow transplant center with a freaking central line hanging out of my juggler vein. You know, that army that we organized and attacked them in San Clemente that day, well, that was my crowd. That was my crowd. We, Johnny, Johnny Ray and I snuck into San Onofre, exposed the fake union workers. That was my people. That was my crowd. You know, they fear me. That was a major, major, major accomplishment in human rights in the history of mankind, selling out San Lafrey. May Think about 40 million Californians, you know, handful of us, 10 of us group that really got it shut down. I mean, the whistleblowers come to me when I was in a bone marrow trance at LDS with a central line hanging on my jugular, dying when they were leaking this stuff to me. I was leaking to Barbara Boxer's office, sending it, you know, local media comes forward. Do you know what a major accomplishment? Look, we. Yankees done, Pilgrims done, the Sheralds done, we're mowing them down, the nuclear cartel. The accomplishment, Blue Castle, I put the dagger to Blue Castle. The energy solutions dump site right at the, oh no, it ain't coming here because why? They're afraid of jail and they know. I don't even play with them. I go right in, he told me straight up, the secretary of the radiation depository, the state employee, the secretary says, Kevin, you're the only single one. You, only one person ever calls, one person ever gets them, one, one in the entire state of Utah. California, 40 million people. We go to those hearings, the people that get involved, we're talking 10 people. Seriously. You know, so the mass of whatever, this fight is so historic. You know, as I said out there by the bald eagles, you know, everybody's doing these studies and whatever, the Pacific, the Great Salt Lakes, you know, the animals are dying. Eight. Eight eagles returned this year. Eight. Oh, it's just West Nile. For many of the dead grebes. What killed the grebes? What's a grebe? Historic creatures. This is the greatest event, the Great Pacific Genocide in human history. So evil and sad. 
Barack Obama, 32 ships were sent into entombment. One man, one guy, Barry Antoinette, Barack Obama will go down in history as the great killer of all things, one person. He told them to stand down. He's the only one that had that power. He's commander in chief. Yeah, he was being advised by, he's just a stupid puppet, being advised by his nuclear rats that him out. You can look up the video. He didn't know what Hanford was. It shows you what a stupid puppet he is. He's the dumbest puppet this country has ever seen. That's saying a lot, W. That's saying a lot. Now, Bill Walmart Clinton, he was no dumb puppet. He was an evil freaking orchestrator. You know, all these puppets, political puppets, and the American populace self-indulge, me, 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 grotesque as fucking group. Look, our small army, we fight for the future. This, look, I stood out there and, you know, I had that dream. And the animals all circled around me. And they're like, it really rattled me. Kevin, you have to fight harder. You know, and I'm like, I'm fighting, I'm fighting, I'm fucking trying. You know, and then the big blue whale came up. You know, there was a mermaid on its back, and they were all circling around, they were all heads down, and they were all crying. Kevin, you fight harder. You fight harder. If you don't fight harder, we're going extinct. Don't you see? You know, these madmen, the buffalo, the sequoias, they, the migration across across the wide Missouri. Devoto wrote that right here, by the way. You know, wow. These fucking evil European devils, the fucking best thing would ever happen to them. You know, when DeSoto and Columbus, we build monuments. First thing, these so-called fur traders right here, J.L. Smith, fucking Jim Bridge, oh, they're all that? Fuck no, they were fucking here to rape and pillage. The European fucking migration to rape and pillage this ground, they're still doing it to the last fucking tree. Cut down the sequoias, cut down the fucking redwoods. The best thing would have been if fucking those natives would have put arrows right between their fucking eyes, every last fucking one of them. This worse than the European by many, many times. It's become these Europeans that came over here just to fucking rape and pillage the greatest fucking continent, piece of fucking real estate on the earth, the Western United States. Our native fucking, we're all natives here now. Look what they did to us. I will quote Russell Mees again. You Europeans come here preaching your Christianity and telling us how we're going to get to heaven. This is how you get to heaven. Before you got here, we had heaven. We had no disease, we had no jails, we all, they lived in communal harmony, you know, with the environment. Look what we've done. The last fucking piece, last piece, they come for the mighty blue lady, the Pacific Ocean. She's going to fight back, and I'm going to fight to my last fucking breath and fucking try. You know, and I have done a lot. You know, the close of San Onofre is such a major, major accomplishment. You know, I put it on my tombstone. I never answered to anyone, and I fought him to the death. You know, the blocking of Blue Castle on the green, what a major accomplishment in my life. Fucking, to block the DU, fucking 700 that coming in here, this fucking monetizing cabal, what an accomplishment. All these people, the great people of Vermont that kicked the fuck Yankee out of there. The small group, the fucking Cape Codders that kicked the fucking Pilgrim the fuck out of there. All these people are doing, Fitzgerald, Indian Point's fucking next. Fuck, we will get Diablo Canyon as soon as I get the emails from that fucking Rat Brown. The only reason, the only reason Diablo Canyon is still alive, Jerry Brown vetoed that skull and bones fucking rat. And all you people that Prophet Kalen stood on this fucking side, oh, my mommy told me a smart, we have other nuclear reactors, we have hydrogen reactors. We have, no you don't, you fucking liars. You fuck these people that know a little bit about a lot, they got podcasts, whatever, they're pathetic fucking air sucking fucking earth crawling pieces of scum. But we, as our fucking small tiny art, we care about our grandkids, we care about our future. We fucking fight for the people these mass murder. And I'm a big believer in prayer. And you evangelicals, take your faith back. Take your religion back. You Mormons, take your faith back, you fucking what they've done to you. You global as fucking. Jesus did not die so you could be rich. Fucking Joel Steen's a criminal rat. They all are. That fucking mainstream media, all of them, they're fucking criminals. And please stop in California. The great Pacific genocide, the killing of the Pacific Ocean, the greatest event in human history. It's not from a fucking warm current. El Nino. The fuck, what is that? The Spanish word for Christ child? Little child? Little boy, right? Right? You know, the Latin word for calm. She's not going to be calm much fucking longer. You fuckers, you're tiny, sit fucking, little fucking, arrogant fucking, wee, me, 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 fucking, you know, dog walking, fucking, air sucking, fucking, Johnny got his gun, fucking cowards. Fucking self indulged fuckers, but not all of us are that way. We're waking up individuals every fucking day. Just remember this. Just two years ago, 34% of these fainting fucking goats were anti nuclear in this country. Today, 64%, soon to be 90%. We are waking these fuckers up because we fucking tell the fucking truth. 
the fucking nuclear energy takes 144 times more than the sun. We don't need no new technology. We have the solar. Oh, you can't store it. Yeah. Why do you need to store it? The solar farms are on in the Mojave. The sun shines all day, every day. Where'd you sleep last night, Kev? I slept in the dead fucking pines where the red sun from Fukushima, Japan always shines for time and all eternity, and so the fuck did you, you arrogant air sucker. Stop with the El Nino nonsense. Fucking, let's fucking try to fucking say before every one of them is extinct, we're on the verge of fucking extincting the fucking, the greatest fucking ecosystem on our, we're on the verge. They're all starving to death. You know, the salmon, it's over. Go buy your fucking boats. People will go buy a boat even though they don't even know why they bought a boat. Fuck, they're just so addicted to fucking shopping, so we park it in my driveway. Fishermen who can't fish, skiers who can't ski, surfers who can't surf. They've lost all connection with the fucking earth. They've lost all connection with the moon, the sun, the sky, the fucking, you know, the water, the fucking wind. They've lost all connection. That's not being a human. That's lost all fucking reality of fucking humanity. You're not human anymore. You're transformed into this blob, this thing that's unhuman, unfeeling. And when you go there, you've lost all the beauty and fucking joy of this fucking gift called fucking life. Not me. I'm going to fight for... You know, it, I, I am fucking heartbroken. Can you imagine starving to death? The mammals are just like you and I. Their chemistry is 90 price hits our biology. They're just like us. You know, starving to death is a horrible way to fucking die. The mirrors, all of it, you know. Pacific Ocean's fucking dying right in front of your face. The greatest fucking, the great, as I named it on fucking, I named it the Great Pacific Genocide on fucking March fucking 12, 2011. Wow. Keep attacking me, fucking rats. Brand your fucking soldiers, because you're no fucking match for my light. Those people that were mass murdered and fucking killed by this nuclear car, their light's inside of me. It shines. I'm doing what I got to do. Fucking, I hope every one of you rats who fucking provocated this, Gina McCarthy, Barry Antoinette, all of them, fucking the media, fuck, I hope you get fucking some kind of fucking cancer in your fucking eyes and it eats your brain away and you're sucked into hell because that's where you're going to go, wherever hell is. Every one of you, when it, your teeny life, when you go, you're going to be sucked into a fucking black hole hell for time and all eternity because that's where the fuck you belong. Stop with the Nino fucking bullshit. Warm currents do not fucking mass murder the fucking greatest fucking ecosystem on earth. People do. Humans do. Stay in tune it.